Hey everyone, it is Tuesday. It's my last day of my fall vacation and that means I am at home. I have to do some cleaning and empty the key litters and just kind of chillax. I go back to work tomorrow, yay. Um, so I thought that I would, um, now that vacation's over, in order to save some money and to recoup <laughs> from vacation, um, that it's eating at home for all my meals and also because I'm going back to my healthy eating and tracking that I decided to do a couple of big stock ups. Yesterday after I got off got off the plane I went over to a Walmart over in Mechanicsville and picked up some items. I didn't do a haul but got oatmeal, I got some fruits, apples and stuff but I didn't really like their selection of vegetables so I was very disappointed in that. I got a turkey roast um, some of those flatbread pizzas and some meatballs because I'm going to make spaghetti tonight. Then I'm going to put some spaghetti sauce on the crock pot in a moment put it on high and it'll be done in like five hours. And of course I had to stock up. One of the reasons I went to Walmart is to really get the dog food and cat foods um, that I needed. So, and then today I decided um, to procrastinate cleaning and <laughs> picking up and packing, unpacking everything to go to Aldi's. So I actually did a very, very big Aldi's haul. There's the boys. Um, and I shouldn't have to really do any real grocery shopping minus, you know, picking up some fresh vegetables and fruits and cat food, dog food, and dairy for the next couple of weeks. Um, and when I mean couple of weeks, I mean I think I can get through most of the month with what's in my freezer, what I bought yesterday, and what I need to find a room for here today. So let's do this. As I said, it was a fairly significant Ollie's haul, but I had to stock up on a bunch of stuff. Um, and because I plan on eating here, home, here. <laughs> okay, so I picked up for five sixty one. dollars it's almost three pounds, this pork roast. Um, and then I picked up, they have these on sale for five ninety nine. dollars the rotisserie turkey breast tenderloins. There's two in there if you're wondering, sorry, two in there. Um, I'll throw them in the freezer along with this package of pork sausage, breakfast sausage. I got this chorizo, they had them on sale for $1.99, it's a two pack. And I'm gonna throw some in with the spaghetti sauce. I like to do put it. I've started liking putting it in spaghetti sauces or the chilies, adds an extra flavor and it kind of just melts into it. I picked up some wings to put in the freezer for when I get that craving, and so that way I'm not ordering wings. And it has some really good wing sauce from the dollar store of all places, so um, that's good. I picked up some bananas. You're gonna see two packs. There were some homeless traveling kids out, or maybe not even kids out um, in front of Aldi's asking for food and I told them if they were still there I'd bring them some stuff so um, I picked up a couple items but they weren't there so <laughs> I have way too many bananas um, so I guess I'll just give it to uh, Melissa my dog walker since I'm doing a pantry clean out and I have some stuff for her anyways because she's a young boy so and I have way too much food but anyways bananas broccoli crowns these were way too expensive I think this bag was $2.99 and they don't look as good as I wish they did um, I'll steam them up tonight, but I have a craving for broccoli. I guess my body wants broccoli. So we'll um, steam that up tonight and have it um, this week with some fish. Um, I got a bag of oranges for some fruits. I got rid of my other ones because I was going away. Um, I picked up mushrooms. I don't normally eat mushrooms, but since I'm trying to eat healthier, I figured maybe I'll saute those up with some chicken and some onions and some vegetables. I picked up their eggs. I normally buy eggs from my little market, but I want to do baking for some sweet when I get that sweet craving and I'll hard boil some of these and um, just have them for snacks so I got a thing of Mexican style cheese uh, I'm gonna have sandwiches for lunch at work for this week and next week so I got the spouted seven grain bread because we we're trying to eat healthier and get more fiber in um, this was a splurge it just, it just smelled so good it's a breakfast bread it's a pumpkin cobbler it just smells so good and I figured that'd be really good for um, um, breakfast this week uh, maybe it'll make me actually eat it. I picked up a couple of the little peanut butter um, toast crackers because I gotta start restocking my snack, lunch snack things. I cleaned it out and now I'm restocking it. Cleaned out of stuff that I just don't feel like eating anymore. I got some lunch meat, I got some roast beef, and I got the turkey breast. I got some sour cream because I was out. Um, for the baking, I got this like dark chocolate brownies and this apple crisp, so I figure I'll pick up some apples. Um, when they're on sale at Kroger's and make that one weekend. My um, oyster crackers, I think a half a gallon of organic milk, bones for Maggie, and then here's the stock up. I got some tomato sauces, um, I got corn, more tomatoes, 
goes out of tomato stuff. I got a can of pumpkin for baking or giving to Maggie. Uh, I got a can of northern beans, green beans, tomato paste, pinto beans, uh, more tomatoes, more tomatoes. Um, let's see, cat food. I have some corn, or yeah, I think this is corn or black beans and corn and stuff. So. Uh, up here I have for coffee I got the pumpkin spice I don't always get whole ground uh, whole beans but um, I'll just add this in it just look good that'd be nice for the fall big box of spaghetti this is like four or five meals so good deal uh, a bunch of cat food and dog food just to I bought some a bunch at Walmart but it's always good to have some extras on hand it makes the shop in between shopping trips last longer a thing of sauerkraut because i'm out and this stuff's really good i'm gonna probably cook that with that pork roast in the crock pot one weekend i got some can uh, cannellini beans i'm looking at a kale sausage cannellini like super toscana soup but um kale is very expensive so i'll wait until that goes on sale um this is another se seasonal item i thought i'd pick it up it's pumpkin butter i don't know it looked good i have all those little bagels and breads and stuff so pumpkin cane sugar lemon juice spices so, I need salsa. I need jalapenos. It's completely out. So, speaking of why I really want to Aldi's is for the fruits and vegetables. So, I got these uh, green peppers. They look really good. I think we've already done over here. Broccoli, bananas. Um, and then down here, because I can't fit everything, um, a bag of onions. A bag of Brussels sprouts. These last in the fridge for a while, so... Um, if I don't eat them right away. Caesar salad kit and Italian salad kits. I was really not impressed with the Walmart selection of vegetables and salad stuff. The thing of peanut butter for Maggie. Here's the bananas I bought for those kids. I also bought two things of chili with beans for them. Um, I wasn't going to, I'm not going to eat them, so I guess I'll give them to Melissa. And I also picked up some of those crackers. Two avocados. They were a little pricey, but I've been craving avocados. And then a couple of bottles of the Winking Owl wine um, for this weekend well maybe one today and one for this weekend and then finally I picked up some non grocery items I picked up these lint rollers because I need to stock up on those and then they had these long sleeve shirts for $12.99 I have gotten their um, tank tops and one of their t-shirts when they were on clearance and they were really really good I really like the fit and the colors and the materials so um, rather than waiting for these to go on clearance and there weren't that many left and I just picked these up because I need some new shirts for the ball. Anyways, guys, I'm back. I'm going to clean up around the house, get that stuff started, and read a book and watch true crime, and then head back to the real world tomorrow. Thank goodness. I am definitely over vacation. <laughs> okay, I will talk to everyone later. I hope you have a lovely day. Don't look at my floor. Yep. Yeah. Okay, bye guys.